Hi guys, welcome back to Ducky Garage. Today we'll be putting back the bumper for my um, R8. So um, a couple weeks ago, I take out the bumper to put a new exhaust X pipe, and um, I want to keep it, uh, keep it, uh, keep the bumper off and see how it look for a while and play around with it because you know a lot of people with twin turbo have the bumper off and it look pretty cool. I think it's pretty cool and mine not twin turbo, but I just want to expose the exhaust. You can see the transmission and everything, and um, since mine is a manual, every time you shift, you can see all the shift linkage and everything move. It's pretty pretty cool in the back. Yeah, today I'll be putting the bumper back and everything, uh, all the part back. Also, I got this new exhaust tip that is pretty nice, but I got to use, not new. So, um, here, let me, uh, let me move it close. Let me show you the comparison over here. So, um, so this exhaust tip from Akupovic, right, it's, it's like, um, aftermarket one. Yeah, so, um, a lot of people put the V10, um, uh, exhaust tip on the V8 bumper and, um, so the shape of the hole with the exhaust, uh, the exhaust of the V8, right, the, um, it's, it's not round, it's not oval, it's more of, um, like a pill shape, right? So um, if you put the V10 tip in, it don't fill up the hole correctly, and it look kind of funky to me. But a lot of people do it. But um, I got this one that I actually make for the V8 bumper since it's a pill shape instead of that oval weird oval shape. And this is um, forged carbon. I got a use. I think um, new is like. Three something four hundred bucks for it on eBay I saw, but not a lot of um. It's hard to find this one this day, so I got to use from this one gentleman and um, he's local, and um, I got it for like ninety bucks. It's pretty nice. It should fit that hole nicely, not like the V ten tip on the V eight. Yeah, I gotta get rid of this one. If anybody want it for the Audi R eight, let me know for the V eight R eight. Let me know you can. I can let it go for cheap. <laughs> Nice carbon fiber. Yeah, I can uh, let it go for cheap. Yeah, two of them. All right, guys. After a whole night of struggling with the bumper, I finally got it back on. But um, so this is the problem last night. Um, there's the impact bar, right? And I, I took out the impact bar last time to expose the exhaust. And uh, when I reinstalled the impact, impact bar yesterday, I didn't install it further in enough. So when I installed the bumper, it wouldn't let the bumper uh, line up uh, with the fender. So I need to redo everything and take the whole bumper out, the fender well out, impact bar back out, and uh, remount the impact bar. So it takes so damn long, and it was so frustrated, and <laughs> I'm about to lose all my hair. But uh, I finally got it back on, the bumper's lined up. Um, I'm, about to, I'm, about to put, I'm about to put the fender well back on, the wing back on, and a um, couple of the engine uh, cover back on, and we should be good. I'll take some uh, video and photo and show you guys how it looks afterward. And um, also, yeah, the new, the new uh, exhaust tip, but uh, actually not new, but new to me, was used. So um, those, those out. I bought the car with it. And it's up for sale. I got um pose it up if anybody wanted. it. It's a decent shape. I can clean it up a little bit and uh, take a better picture for you guys. And uh, this is the new forged carbon one. Like I said, I gotta do um, a full video or a uh, picture of the car after I'm done. We'll probably pull it out so I do so you guys can see the whole car uh, with the new side skirt and everything. I really love the outcome of the um, side skirt and the Zox tip. So, uh, I hope you yeah, I like <laughs> what I'm doing to my car. You know, everybody has different tastes, but uh, this is my taste. <laughs> oh my God, All, this whole time, I finally got the diffuser back on. <laughs> yeah, this thing takes forever to put it back on. Like, yeah, we, doing an exhaust parade is not a um, one day task or a couple hour task, it's like more like a whole day task. So be prepared for it if you uh, ever plan to do your uh, exhaust for your parade. Because a pain in the but yeah, to remove all this stuff out. So uh, be prepared for it. I warn you. <laughs> all right, update, guys. So um, finally put the bumper on, put the wheel back on. 
I love it. <laughs> it looks so clean about the wing. I was thinking maybe leak like this. What do you think? So I'm now gonna start back the wing back on and um, yep. All right, stay tuned, yay. All right, guys, I finally installed the wing and everything in the car. It took me forever. So it took me literally two days. I start on Sunday and yesterday I work a little bit and I struggle with the impact bar, but uh, today we finally put everything back. So uh, here, take a look at the car. So what do you guys think? Yeah, I love the new exhaust tip. You get the clean look. They fill up the hole nicely. Got the new tip put on and um, the new side skirt. I gotta go for a car wash now. I don't know what you got, but uh, I really miss having the bumper back. They look way better with the bumper and the diffuser and the uh, wing. What do you guys think? 